Hey folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Surviving Mars! Another pretty chill day for me here, and I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna take it easy. Play some Surviving Mars. By the way, none of these episodes have gone live yet, mostly just uh, using this as a more relaxed game to fill my recording time, and then when the series will be ready, and when there's maybe a little bit of a gap in some other videos, I'll be putting them online. So, if I haven't been responding to things in real time, it's because of that. I like this game. I think it's really... It's, it's relaxing despite the incredible amounts of stress that can happen um, on occasion. <laughs> um, but, you know, other than that, it's fine. That has been a little bit since I recorded the last session. But looking at this, we are a little low on electronics, though theoretically producing more. I think we've mostly been, we've been doing a lot of construction with it. We also don't have a tremendous amount of food currently. Um, we do have a couple of farms that are... Well, no, you're pretty far away from it. You've got some food coming soon. But even then, I'm not going to call it plentiful in any way. Especially if right now our consumption is about 32 per per soul. Um, yeah. Five souls for 55 food. We're definitely not making enough to be self-sufficient. Um, we may be able to spend money on, on food imports, though. That might not be too bad. We only have 32 days to reach our target of research. But honestly, I'm feeling pretty okay with things currently on that front and yeah we are setting us up up for some increased birth rate and then some better um better food production as well let's bring the speed up to fast here which with my mod is the same as fastest just kick it up a notch i do love seeing these little shuttles here this is actually one of my favorite things in uh, survive mode i think a part of it goes back to the very first game i played of this when i I think when I first got my preview copy, I got the, um, as my background, I got the, what is it, Rocket Scientist or whatever, the one that starts you with the shuttle hubs um, unlocked. And it's just like, oh my god. And then when you don't have it, you're like, no, this is terrible. So I always see it as, as such an important thing, but they also just There's look nice. More to the barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. I don't think those are going to change things too much. We do have some buildings not working, because it's true, we don't have enough people. Um, that is definitely the case. We have 117 free homes, 63 empty jobs, which is actually the, the more important critical number. Even here, you can see there's a bit of a shortage on some things. Uh, probably lots of people being educated. We could cancel one of the education shifts just to... You know what? I will do that, actually. So some people moved into the afternoon. I'm canceling the night shift, which is going to save us a little bit of sanity, but um, might keep a few more people in some critical jobs for a little bit longer, some of these service buildings, because otherwise people are going to get pretty cranky. And cranky people don't make no babies. Sector soul after soul. Oh yeah, the dredgers. Our scientists work their fingers to the bone, trying to find a solution to our incoming dredger so There's new problem. tech, dredger morphology, we can research, um, which can be increased by, that's a, expeditions near landed dredgers will help their efforts. Okay. We'll just keep an eye out when it tells us that there's a dredger landing. Although I think it lands with an anomaly and our, um, our little... Machine will go and auto scan anomalies just like it's doing over here. We're just scanning the last of the few, I think, originally unscanned sectors, and then we're just doing a bunch of deep scans now. So we won't detect any more anomalies just through sector scans. More might show up if there's meteors that land, but that is about it. How are we doing a Martian War? Only 16. Mm. Oh, one of my rockets did get home. Um, I do want to send more passengers, but I think I'm going to send a cargo rocket full of food just to make sure nothing really, really stupid happens. Really stupid. If we happen to run out of food completely, that would be terrible. Um, we've got plenty of concrete. I don't really have a concrete dump right now. Break we could set up some discovered. trade, but you know, I keep pissing off the A. Whoa. Now that, I don't think I've ever seen this breakthrough. Drones carry two resources at once. That really, huh. And there's a dredger tech. Um, I'm trying to decide how... That would definitely accelerate a lot of things around. I mean, I want to research it. I'm just trying to decide about prioritizing. I think I still want... Um, I think I still want the farming stuff there first. So I'll just put it in the queue. I'm not going to go and queue up the dredger morphology right now. Because apparently we can increase it with some... Uh, ooh, you've got some it's, we can increase it with some anomaly scanning. Uh, we're going to drop you down and then you over here. Because apparently you need some research extra room. Actually, complete. the same case over here. I'll just drop a couple of those. Holographic scanning is complete. So medical centers, so not infirmaries, but medical centers, which, um, do we even have one? No. I'm talking about maybe putting a network node here, but maybe I should put a network, um. Hmm. 
Yeah, well, I'm not gonna put any because we don't have any workers, but yes. Uh, I guess this is all, that was all a setup to a baby making gnome, which we may be a little far to do. Uh, annoyingly, here's the thing. Um, I don't want to put down another dome until we have more people, but we can't really have more people until we make more babies. So, I don't know. We will launch another rocket over here. Hmm. Uh, as I say, maybe we start, you know, kidnapping people. I mean, recruiting people from other settlements. But I think a lot of them, they, they still hate me so much that any spy job's not really viable either. Hmm. Sector it's nice that we have unlimited power. Found. Another dredger has landed, which did bring an anomaly as well. So that's going to get scanned for us. Okay. And advance some of our tech. Thank you very much. Oh, it's like, what wasn't John doing down here? But yeah, you're still picking up resources. Excellent. We do have a lot of metal right now, which is great. We still don't have any metal mining. We do have... Um, right here. Machine parts factory. And it's got a metal depot and it's asking for 30. Okay, good. You'll always be supplied by that. That's going to be fine. We have tons of machine parts. Okay, this is not full yet, which is good because it would be a little annoying if it fills up. Uh, but it's just two shifts and no one's working overtime. That's good. We still have the extra workload over here, and this isn't filled up yet, but I don't think I want to throw more people in there. The electronics we have, the numbers are going up. That's great. You're done there, you're done there. Take me a second after I click to load something. What's running in the background? Uh, that's what's running in the background. Um, hang on. Like, something is something is obliterating my, my hard drive here. Um... That should be okay. All right. Do 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 do. Sector I'm gonna scan. kill that too, just cause. Ah, oh, yeah, that's better. That is better. All right, you're here. You're the one with lots of food. Oh. Mission control. We've got our first detailed analysis of a landed dredger. Okay. Molecular spec. Spectroscopy to scan the rubidium strontium proportion. Okay. Uh, technology costs reduced by 50%. That's great. Must originate from a solar system. Uh, yeah, unless they can travel FTL. Um, yeah, that is really helpful. So it's down to 10,000 science. I wonder if we can do that a couple more times. Mm -hmm. Colonists are departing. Yeah. That's a little annoying, but I mean, they weren't working already for us. So I guess that's just going to be that. Just out of curiosity, actually, let's double check. Um, yeah, bad minus 53. I mean, stealing drones might be a possibility. We don't really need more drones. Minus 53, minus 30. Yeah. Okay. I think that gets better over time. Sometimes there's events. Um, I don't know if there's anything we can do. I mean, maybe we have an option. Can we, like, send gifts? Here, I'll send you a gift so that we can... I have a lot of concrete. I don't... You don't want that... I do have a ton of machine parts. We can fling them some machine parts. It's only 25. And then we can start spying on them again? I don't know if that's worth doing. I mean, resources are important. I think I'm just going to hold off for now. A big crater over there. I do like the landscapes they've got set up. I was just thinking, well, we've got this rover. Do I want to? Do I want to flatten anything? Does anything matter? Well, actually, over here maybe, because we may conceivably want to do some work there. Um, let's land this rocket uh, over here. And yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Um, flatten. Okay, and dig in as much as we can. Hold shift. Yeah, let's say I'm drawing a pretty big thing. The too large isn't isn't about the absolute number of. Um, squares, I think. It's, like, New literally the proportions. Have arrived. Yeah, smooth a little crop bit of that. Failure reported. No edible. Yeah, that's over here, the crop failure. Anomaly that's okay. Found. Another anomaly? Is it from another dredger? No. Oh? What the hell? Wait. Can you find more anomalies when you deep scan? I mean, we must have. Alright. Yeah, that, I think, is totally okay. And yeah, you guys can leave again. Um... Well, there are, are you? Earth -sick colonists. I mean, I'll send at least one of you home to bring these earth sick away. Maybe I'll send you both, because there's not that many people waiting for us back home right now. And then you're you're gonna just go and dig that, which is fine. Um, rare metals. You know what? I'm gonna control click here for the exports, so we're gonna start to allow that. I will still launch this one right away. 
But yeah, we're going to start to allow exports. Now, right now, I think that none of our Universal Depots are set to have rare metals. So there's some over here. So rockets that land over here will be within range to get loaded from that. And I think that's going to be okay. So if we land over here, they can't get rare metals. And I think I'm fine with that. Research complete. I don't want to send it all out. Okay, uh, decrease number of workers. That's huge. We're going to do that right away. Boom. Because we do have a general shortage of workers. So control clicked on there. So we're going to upgrade all of our farms to need fewer people. Um, the mega storage. I mean, maybe I want the gene adaptation first. You know what? Let's do that. Um, gene, the uh, the mega storage is, is cheaper and faster. And I mean, we want it because we need we do need to store a lot for all the dust storms. But we actually have pretty good storage on all those things right now because we built a lot of the little guys. So I think we're okay. For work search and here your double education shifts but i think it's okay if we if we don't rush through educating all of our non-specialists because we need some non-specialists still you can see all these buildings are empty right now because maybe maybe our educational program is too strong too strong i'll probably leave it as is though um because as our population grows one university won't be enough to educate anyone in fact we might still want to open up the night shift again and then still we will have lots of non-specialized people to run all the other shifts that's going to be okay. Or, I mean, what's going to happen is just we're going to fill up all the specialist roles. And then, um... Anomaly and then analyzed. there won't be as much There's need for the education. The and it'll just, it'll balance itself out. Red planet than meets the eye. Resilient architecture. Outgoing buildings need less maintenance. I think I still want all this stuff queued as is, but I want it in there. Um, we might, you know what, I'm going to stick this at the top, stem reconstruction. It is expensive. Uh, maybe gene adaptation first is still fine, because we do need to get our food up a little bit. Um, but this will actually make a huge difference to our workload, because right now, a bunch of our workforce just doesn't work because of age. And since we are having overall, you know, just total number of people shortages, this will effectively increase the total number of people we got. All right, we still need the double soybean over here, but yeah, we went from six to four people needed to run the farms, which is going to help a fair bit with what we're looking to do. We also do have the, uh, you know, the botanists everywhere, so they're working um, more efficiently, which is nice. You're still stocked by, or moving this, you're moving this over here. Okay, overall, very pleased with this. Uh-huh. I don't think there's anything else I need to really do right now. Let's go to the maximum speed. Which is really a blessing, because um, there's, there's often a lot to do in this game, but sometimes there's a little bit of a of a lull. I mean, I could, you know, I can easily construct more, but what would be the point, right? I don't have this stuff. Um, we could still build more shuttles, but we don't really need more shuttles, and I'm still just kind of worried about the amount of electronics we've got. Um, you know, as we get Sector more people scan. moved in here, it's going to be okay. Yeah, still no more Martian borns. Yeah, we just don't have enough comfort going on. Doesn't help that these service buildings aren't being worked. Maybe, you know what? Let me cancel one of the shifts here at the Machine Park Factory. You have a lot. We'll save a little bit more power. Not that our power is really a problem right now, but it'll help a re, um, reorganize some. people, move some engineers into the Electronics Factory, which we definitely don't want to scale down. Um, how about our Polymer Factories? Because uh, we have tons of those too. I think I'm going to... Control click, so we'll only have the one shift. Um, I'm also going to control toggle this, just in case our old one, because we had another one, right? There's this one, and oh, there it is, right there. Yeah, I don't know if it had like the um, the heavy workload or not. We clearly don't need it. We'll do that. Um, oh, oh, we have tons. Okay, great. Launch you. Um, you know what? I'm going to launch you as well. We do need more people. Food's okay, right? Yeah, we're over 200, which feels nice. Have some Earth sick colonist again. But yeah, pulling out back on the production of those two is nice. In fact, arguably, maybe we don't need uh, two of the polymer factories. But we did for a little while. Um, dome construction in particular ate lots of polymers, so we're happy to have that. Um, I could go in and unlock the construction of this dome. But we're really not going to be putting anything in it for a while. So, not much point. Sanity breakdown, Luddite vibe. Um, forget about the building. You know what? Forget about the building. Save the colonist. Um, building destroyed. There it is. That's fine. We'll just uh, we'll just rebuild this drone hub. 
Mission Control, we've got an incoming message from our sponsor. An encrypted one. You want me to destroy dredgers? I'm pretty sure our actions have political backing. I don't remember where the last dredger landed. Uh... Yeah, Research I don't complete. know. Speed adaptation. Okay, so that's going to be our crops getting changed up over here. So what we're going to do to all the farms is... So fruit trees are the new... Yeah, fruit trees are the new soybeans. Because increases soil quality by 10%. 10%. Um, oh, eight souls versus five. But more than double the food. So it's 75% longer per growth cycle, but more than 100% more food per growth cycle. So it's clearly better. I'm going to add that in. I'm control clicking over here. And then corn is the new potato. Yeah. Uh, still go. We'll do we'll do this, this, this. Um, and I think it ruined this harvest. I mean, I already kind of I changed the other farms, but that's not the end of the world. Um, maybe I don't know. Are you still destroyed? Or are you fixed yet? Nearly. It costs us more electronics, but there we go. And grit. The uh, the I'm the drones went and regrabbed themselves. Um, I should have because this is quite a walk over here, and I I know I don't use the um. The recharging stations enough and i really should let's put one down there because there's plenty of drones that move down i did put down a few recharge stations yeah yes i did this time but i think one over there would be good okay dredger landed on mars so there's anomaly being scanned and did it say something what was that? open fire maybe i need to finish the research before yeah i don't know well passengers on board drop you over here at least for now Sector scanned. And oh, and the other one's here too, which I don't think has as many people, but that's okay. New colonists have arrived. Good, good, good. Yeah, normally being scanned. Colonists are departing. Mission control. We've got RC Explorer operators reporting in from the dredger analysis site. Okay, so it's another 50% discount. It's going to be real cheap now. Yeah, we're, oh, there you go. It's just giving us the free research, basically. I wonder if we researched it again. No, probably wouldn't. Um, you know what? Let's throw it on top now. Because I think doing the scan one more time would just give us, what, 12.5% progress? Which isn't really enough to, you know, to really hang on a postcard. Okay, yeah, we're... The problem is we're burning through a lot there of people here because colonists. of the, uh, the missing service buildings and people getting cranky. Um... Okay, I have a ton of money. What I'm going to do... I'm going to toggle that shift off. We're we're probably going to go down in electronics, but what I'm doing is sort of rolling the dice, especially with our exports enabled now. Um, we'll probably buy some electronics to cover that. And you can see our our, um, our jobs went from, what, we were at like 60 and change to 30 and change, so that's much better. Ooh, new planetary anomalies. Project Miss. We need an RC Dozer for research progress. Okay. Security, research project, progress, resources, a breakthrough. There you go. And it's five many people. So let's uncover the breakthrough first. And here you're waiting for, um, oh, hold on. I didn't have fuel enabled over here. Resources are low. Actually, it's as I think I usually, I turned it off for the universal storage depots, which is actually, yeah, which is going to be good. And a habit I want to keep going. So I'm just going to go and put a fuel storage over here and I'm going to ask for 30 fuel to be banked there which is enough for a load and yes we are low on electronics that is indeed the case we do have one rocket going home and yeah it's probably going to buy electronics which means we can't outsource this time but I think that's okay Dredger morphology is coming along okay, we have the blessing to go and trash the dredgers so I'm assuming this is what this tech is going to unlock for us do 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 do. Feels being stored here too. Which is fine. Um, actually, do we want to? Well, no. I kind of like this sectors because there's scanned. some fuel production. Okay. Complete. Oh, we've scanned all achieved. sectors. Dredger morphology. Knowing the unknown. We've completed the final analysis on the dredgers, but as is all too common with the mysteries we encounter, it raises more questions than it answers. That's vulnerable. Um, so we can blow up these dredgers. 
I don't know. Hostility, hostility should be our last resort. But... We gotta take at least one apart. Right? They overload its fuel system. We gotta take at least one last resort. I'm gonna do it immediately. It's for science! Hmm. Does a drone do it? It might be a drone that does it. Move an RCC Grover here. Funding received. Oh, I might be able to, uh, you know, yeah, you're close enough. I bet, oh, no, I can't actually right-click on the drone. I can't right-click on this building. But what I can do is I can assign you to this. There you go. Now you'll be in the radius, and you'll go to work on this thing. I wonder if we can have, like, more? Okay. All you all. Um, it's recharged, but you're actually being assigned here, right? Yeah, five drones assigned. Oh, okay, so it looks like three is the most we can use to tear this apart. Again, there's... Although having spares, I guess, helps with the recharging. It takes a while to tear that apart. All right. Again, I'm fairly okay with things. Um... Eleven, yeah... Oh, um, for safety, let's do a cargo rocket full of electronics. Yeah, and I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and just spend everything on a big giant load of electronics. It's gonna help us manage our workforce a lot better. More earth sick, which is, is annoying. Did we get resources? Oh, electronics from tearing that apart. Okay. So you can just I don't know go hang out over here for now I guess. I mean I could send you out to do sensor tower stuff, but meh. Great dust storm approaching. Great dust storm, not just a regular dust storm. A great death storm. We'll call it Alexander. Uh, oh, you can automate this too. Well, let's do that. I forgot I had a fungal farm. Let's totally do that. Right, you're still working hard to get educated over here. Within the restrictions of how many work zones I've got. We've got one more Martian born, but yeah, it's definitely a problem. Um, do I want to tweak some of the priorities? I wonder if, like... Maybe. There's renegades in this dome. Alright, well, I'm happy we've got some of those. And you're doing this. Oh, okay, you're done the potato thing. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to control click on the corn. And the thing is, you're already at 90% here, so we can go and cancel one of these fruit tree jobs. Um, you're at 90%, so that'll go to 100, so we can cancel you into there corn. That's great. Colonists. And then over here, I might just want to keep going on fruit trees. No, we'll throw in the corn, that's going to be okay. All right, and... Oh, another dredger has landed on Mars. So, you didn't leave an anomaly. Colonists are departing. I don't know, I'll leave you there. Destroyed one for science, didn't really do anything for us. Colonists oh, departing. Ooh. Man. Unload all the electronics. I don't know, do we have a dedicated electronic storage over here? The polymers. Let's get a dedicated electronics depot. Especially since we do have our production of there electronics over here. Colonists. Oh, throw that down. Just to make sure there's enough space to fully unload this. We'll probably send you back to Earth. Because, yeah, you're doing a planetary anomaly. So, yeah, we'll send you back to Earth. As soon as you're unloaded. There we go. You can take the Earth sick. But, yeah, I'm worried because our population's not increasing here. And that's just a lack of comfort, which is related to not enough jobs. Um, actually, I'm going to turn off both the Hawking's Institutes. Yeah, I like that. And then you're just full of concrete, which is going to have to be okay. A recent detailed analysis of the dredgers reveal that they're sending signals towards... The oh, destroying dredgers question. using drones reduce the cost of the technology? Well, I guess it just became necessary. Um, you, come over here. Destroy this. We're going to blow up a bunch of dredgers, and that's just the way it's going to have to be. For science! Stem reconstruction. Yeah, I'm still hoping that's going to help with our workforce situation. Oh, we only have 20... Oh, yeah, because I did close some buildings. That's good. It's going to help rebalance some of the, uh, the workload across some important service buildings that we absolutely need. You over here, you've been upgraded, so you don't need workers. Yeah, good. Excellent. A storm arriving soon. We won't be able to launch or land shuttles or rockets while that's going on. And our shuttles will be offline. Actually, 
do this and try to encourage some food to get moved over here. We've got a good amount. We just need to make sure there's enough here that they won't starve while things are shut down. I will be able to use the uh, the transport, um, the RC transport here to move food manually. We do have the tunnel, but it's awkward, and I'd rather just. Our science Chinese puzzle? team is busy with the scant remains of the What's destroyed. The Chinese treasure? puzzle. What's the reference to that? I mean, there's, I'm thinking like there's the Chinese finger trap. What's Chinese puzzle? I don't know. I am puzzled by this. All right, we got 50% progress towards dredger wavelength decoding. I'm going to assume we can get another 50% if we just dismantle one more. Funny and that seems like a pretty good thing to wait for. All right, rare metals arrived. Um, unfortunately, I should, this, this rocket won't make it before the dust storm. So I should probably just wait. Um, we are fully stored of everything, yes. Water is still going to come during the storm. Oxygen won't, but we've got a thousand stored. And the demand is, what, five per per hour? Yeah, okay, so that's going to be A-OK. -okay. No problems there. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and, and build uh, the extra shuttles here. Because as soon as the storm ends, we're going to have a backlog of stuff. And we're wanting these shuttles to, like, jump out as quickly as possible. Uh, so that's going down. <sighs> Building clogged. Don't like dust. It's coarse and rough and irritating. Gets everywhere. A uh, fuel refinery looks like it has jammed something. That's okay. We could just um, we'll just suspend the fuel refinery. We don't need it right now. No reason to risk a person or to use extra materials of any source sort whatsoever. Yeah, that can just be turned off, and I'm okay with that. Um, so I think we're gonna be fine on this. How long is this gonna last? Three. Oh man. Okay, that is gonna be a long one, admittedly, but I think we're okay. Push comes to shove. We could do the amplify on the water extractors. Um, I don't know. Maybe a lot of extra power, and you can't really toggle off the upgrade after. But we can make basically as much power as we want because of our fusion generator um, being unmanned. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm, I'm doing the amplify on all the water extractors just to help um, throughout this a little bit. These leaks are certainly going to be really annoying. And hurt us a lot. Mostly concerned about the oxygen. We had the most storage for it, but we can't generate any during this. Unless we, you know, research oxygen generating plants, but we're not really there. Uh, 27 unemployed people. That is off. The rest being up is probably fine. Renegades over here too, yeah. I mean, people have been pretty cranky. Research. I mean, the complete. second we get a... Um, oh, there we go. The second we get a... Um, a baby making dome up our population is going to skyrocket and maybe i should maybe i should em emphasize it maybe just turn off this dome completely and get everyone to move over here i mean it's possible hmm i often like to have the university there because the baby making dome doesn't really need specialized people we could clear this one out for something else i don't know i don't know nine because i think there's more yeah six renegades four earth sick I don't know if we ever unrenegade people with the uh, security things or just stop them from stealing things. Okay, another dredger has landed. So you're going to come over here and Research you're going to do that. Complete. Mega storage is done. That was pretty cheap. Um, we'll probably put down a couple of mega storages. We don't have to necessarily have to rush it. Artificial muscles is kind of handy. Outdome building maintenance is very nice. Water consumption is halved. That's... Good. And we've got our wonders we could even start working towards, but um, we really do have to make sure our science kicks in at a certain point. What I can do is I can put this at the front here, because you can start researching that. We'll still get the boost from disassembling the one, and it should actually line up kind of okay. Maintaining stuff over here. Yeah, we're going to be fine. We're through most of it right now, and everything's still okay. Obviously, our power's really good. 31 empty job slots, as more people are probably freaking out. How many upgrades for the residences for comfort? We do have the... the farms do generate comfort, which is good. Um, it's home collective, right? Expensive. Oh, throw it in the queue anyway. An RC explorer just brought in materials salvaged from another destroyed dredger. Right, so 50% boost. 
So it brought us up to, I think, 75 by itself, and then we still have the research happening. Uh, I'm just going to bring my Seeker back somewhere so that it can get, you know, some coverage. But yeah, we have this, like, great little research site, and we're not doing anything with it. But it's not like our science rate is that bad. And yeah, we need we need the service buildings and things manned. I suppose I could turn off all these uh, zero-g labs, too. You know what? Actually, let's do that. Yeah, I think that's going to do better for us. Because it should create fewer Earth-sick people, maybe increase our Martian-born birth rate. Anything else I could decide? I mean, I suppose we could turn off our polymer and machine parts completely. And that would probably allow us to consider the baby-making dome. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. And we are going to... Connect you up this way. And get a drone hub. I don't know. Sort of in the middle of these two? Sure. Like that. Bring you up over there. Um, turn off the fuel, rare metals, but otherwise ask for max. The aliens didn't try to destroy our cities. Then again, they didn't try to contact us either. Scientists suggest the current rate of landings, the amount of metals in our sector will be depleted within three years. That's pretty bad. If they eat all of our metals, uh, well, well, we're pretty much dead, right? So maybe we do have to keep destroying them. Low storage of oxygen, but the dust storm is over and we still had some left over. Excellent. Okay, nope, that, that worked out kind of okay. What are you waiting for? Oh, you have some rare metal. Oh. Yes, because I don't allow any rare metals. Um, okay, what I'll do is I'll set this desired amount to zero, but I will allow storage of miscellaneous. Fix the fuel refinery. Good. Sector Wasn't scanned. concerned about it, but anomaly it's there. Oh, we did get another anomaly. There you go. You can finally take off because your uh, rare metals got unloaded. What I'm going to do, I think, is I'm just going to trash this uh, Universal Depot here. Hopefully that problem won't come up again. Uh, do we have one at home? We do. Oh, right, and we can do more passengers. Oh, yeah, and there's lots of people waiting to come. Lovely. We don't have any tech that increases the amount of passengers we can bring at once. Breakthrough which is... discovered. Oh, that's our breakthrough. Double support bonus when colonists are working on a heavy workload. Okay. We can consider that. I think I'm going to make another landing pad over here. Water very low, um, but it might be worth having in this little section a large water tank and a large Break oxygen tank. Discovered. Alien imprints uncovers new anomalies. Alien artifacts which provide a tech reduction to all fields when scanned. Okay, I'm gonna put it in front of the queue, but then I'll put the uh, the dredger because I don't think I don't know if breakthrough counts as one of those fields. But we'll still finish this. Then we'll do alien imprints because it accelerates everything. Give us lots of anomalies to scan. Uh, five passengers. I don't know. I'll just dump you over here for now. Those are the people coming back, right? And you're full because we don't have enough fuel storage. Um, but that's kind of okay. Colonists and some of it will get put in there. Yeah, you were gonna leave, except that you're really not because what you're gonna do now is you're gonna do that and then we'll do the the two science boosters afterwards but yeah no one's gonna be able to leave yet so we'll be told again next time a shuttle lands that someone's leaving mars except probably not because we'll probably do something else with them as well all right so we're waiting for some things to get delivered over here but it's happening pretty quickly now the dredger has landed on mars uh, and apparently they're going to eat all of our resources, so we're going to keep blowing them up. Apparently. Uh, I'll just land you here. New colonists have arrived. Okay, so you're going to go to Mist with our RC Dozer. Sector scan. And get some research progress, although the Dozer is currently occupied. Oh. Waiting for resources. Oh. 
Let me turn off the automation here. Just move you over here so you'll get Anomaly used for things. Analyzed. Um, so you're, you don't have anything to fill with. What we sort of need is a dumping site over here that actually requests some waste rock to be delivered. Oh, we gain rare metals from that. And we do have plenty. And there's a lot of water in section D8. Is it all this one? Yeah, 50,000 high. Wow. Okay. An RC Explorer. Just brought right. We blew up another one. We got some progress. Mostly we're blowing it up so they don't eat our rocks, but I guess that's going to have to keep being okay. You're going to get back over here. You're ready to land. And we have one more anomaly. And mostly we're just waiting for fuel to get loaded up. So we don't have enough drones. Could steal some. I mean, I could uncover the tech to build some. I don't usually bother, but... Stealing might be a thing. Anyway, we're going to go through that. Oh, we have unemployment being reported now. Okay. Oh, and this dome is up. Hold on. So, what we need to do is we need to set up this dome here. And it's going to be fairly different. It would be nice if we had the smart complexes um, for maximum comfort. Can we... I'm, I think this is probably too far away. Although I think there are mods you can use to increase the distance. Oh, no, we can. All right, I wasn't expecting to be able to reach, but we may as well connect them, right? So we'll use living, living complexes, because they are much higher comfort. Oops, that is the wrong place for that one. And you are absolutely going to get the medical center. And services are going to be the next thing. We'll have, I don't know, a full space bar for mingling. Uh, of course, a diner. Um, we might even do a um, casino complex. Uh, let's get a grocer in here. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Um, we want... Whoops. We have small gardens in here. Although, I think we're probably going to want a little bit more than this. Maybe what I'll do is, there you go, we'll fill that wedge like that. Okay, let's not leave this be for a sec while things are getting built up. And yeah, I might just turn off this dome. I would screw up the farming here. Oh, speaking of farming, there is extra comfort to be had from that. So Research let's make sure there complete. is a farm Anomaly actually present analyzed. in this Okay, we language. Done. Our science team has deciphered the so-called language of the dredgers. I think sites will be marked on the map. Is that helpful? I don't know. But we got that tech. We completed that. So, I mean, at least we've advanced our little mystery. We'll do the alien imprints because it'll it'll give us discounts. Seems like a pretty good thing. Man, that is a long freaking tunnel. And let's go and put a ramp on this. So that my drones can get from one side to the other fairly easily. So this dome here, we do want to set a few filters because first of all, because it's baby making, if you're sexy and you know it, you're going to come over here. Um, other than that, I do over here. Set this and that. Colonists are deploying. You know what? I actually will allow fuel on this one um, because this landing pad here will then get, you know, picked up. And people are going to leave. That's going to be okay. Some people are living here. We've got some employment because we don't have any, any jobs set up yet. We want to launch you right away? Yeah, go home. There's probably some people to pick up. And you can finally uh, grab those um, Martianborns and get them the hell out of here. And people in here. Uh, so some people already want some gaming. I mean, we can let's let's go ahead and set up. We're gonna set up the casino. Yeah, we've got the material, although it does add up fairly quickly. One hundred and forty people, twenty Martian born, so that's gone up, and this should go up a lot over here. With the holographic scanner. Team people, judges into light. Another problem on the horizon, a potentially devastating one. Someone leaked the fact that we're blowing up alien artifacts. I'm sure that's not going to blow up in our face. This is fine. 
Um, we got a lot of cash. I don't think we really need to send anything. Oh, our food situation is going up like crazy. These new crops are really helping a lot. So I think I'm going to do an outsourcing. Okay, how many souls we got? Oh shit, we only got 13. Ooh, that's going to be tricky. I think it's doable though. The conference Press conference. The is about to begin. Um, we'll be transcribing the communication on the fly. Give or take five I don't know. We don't know if they're sentient or something. After the applause dies down. The delegates proceed Not to active aggression, but a step towards mutual understanding. Passes. We're just trying to... They, we're only blowing them up so we could understand them. Totally. Or something. Uh, did you arrive? No, you're not there yet. Although, oh, we can't buy another shuttle, no. Do we have to tech to build them? No, because I think we would see it in here, right? Yeah, rocket right over there, but it's grayed out. Okay. If the button is there because the tech has been revealed, but that's it. And RC Dozer, you can go back to being automated now. Since you're done Sector your little scanning. side mission. Okay, nearly back to Earth. Funding received. Passenger rocket. Go, go, go. You're on your way, yeah. Okay. Comfort 56, 57. Gaming gambling. Uh, that's going to get built, so that should be okay. You've got the space there. We're gonna do the farm mostly just because it provides comfort. Okay. Employment, toggling around a little bit. Come on. Make some babies. Okay, it's going up. Your service buildings are being worked right now, so we're going to get more population out of it. Which is going to help keep comfort up. Yeah, oh, and the university. Oh, this is interesting. Even on the triple priority, but... People might be happier moving to this dome. Might be part of it, too. Base bar, some workers missing. Medical center a little bit over there, too. Power's good. Resources are good. Yeah, just make your way Dredger to the anomaly. Detected. Dredger, um, or oh, is landing, but has landed. Well, I mean, are we the baddies? I don't know. We're going to keep destroying these. Watch it just come and blow up in our face. Do, 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 and landing... Of people over here and yeah you now have the 30 fuel waiting which is going to be lovely new colonists have arrived new colonists have indeed arrived and then yeah you're just gonna basically launch immediately back home and get some more colonists ready to go yeah, this and i think the artificial muscle will be nice okay casino is up so the comfort level yeah 68 and climbing okay Prepare yourself for the babies. Um, I'm gonna get down some um, some nurseries. Two for now is gonna have to be okay, and then a school. Food fight. Food service buildings grant more comfort. Import cost reduced. Free construction. No, give us more comfort. That is actually really handy. Twenty-seven people. Yeah, this is gonna go up really fast. Really, really fast. Um, I don't think we have any upgrades for any of these buildings. Except for this one, which we've already got. Nursery is there. Um, yeah, we'll just have you set up on fruit trees. Hell, even this one's not worth very much. We'll do this, and we will automate you. By the looks on the faces of the audience... Your words have made a lasting... Hey, we convinced people! Oh, more applicants. Nice. Okay. Um, yes, take off, please. Okay, that's really great. Yeah, I mean, maybe we really do want the shuttle capacity. Man, how long is this rocket going to take to get to this anomaly? Oh, no, it's just chilling there. Oh, because it's not unloading the rare metals. No. Um, rare metals depot. Oh, yeah, because it's basically full over there. Okay. We're going to turn on more of our buildings soon. And we don't have much research right now because most of the buildings are closed. What do we have? We've got 10 days left to go. But our population is now going to climb. We get the Martian born, and we should have fewer people fleeing. Okay. Let me turn these guys back on. Research don't want people complete. getting educated. Um, alien imprints analyzed. done. Anomaly, anomaly analyzed. analyzed. New anomalies found. Oh, those are all the alien artifacts, which are going to get scanned automatically. 
by my explorer. Okay, good, 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 good. And that finished getting flattened. Lovely. Swell. Thirty Martian born. Thirty-one. And here, yes, no, maybe so. Yeah, I mean you still you still should have plenty of fuel being delivered. You actually might want yeah, I'm going to get you to have fuel over here, too. Anomaly and uh, which is going to stack with that, but that's okay. There you go. Cost of all techs see. decreased. And a shuttle has arrived, so send some power passengers right away. You launch as quickly as possible. we got nine days left to go. Ooh, all right, it is going to be tight. It's going to be very tight. Kids, Anomaly school... Analyzed. Research Artificial muscle, complete. I think that's going to be great for us. Um, anything we've got that can boost research more, I'm not sure. Now you can research the network node, but we already have one available to us. Uh, honestly, just getting the specialty performance up a little bit would be good, I think. Um... I know. Okay. So, more tech discounts, which is still nice, but isn't really, like, the critical thing we're looking for. Negative water? Really? I mean, I guess we did add a bunch of stuff. Oh, I still want a moisture vaporator tech. Uh, let's put that at the front of the queue. There's going to be some dust here regardless, but I guess that's going to have to be just okay. I don't know if I needed that part, but it's all right. Um, I guess if you are going to generate extra dust, it would not be a bad idea to have a scrubber over here. And if I move it to here, I should be able to inbig it and cover the dome. And I'm going to go ahead and amplify you guys, because we still have lots of power. I don't like the fact that we're running negative water. That's crazy. I'm big in you. Eight days left. Rockets moving. Population increasing. And we may have waited too long to pull the trigger on this. Anomaly analyzed. And uh, there's no, not even anyone working on those things, which is not great. No one doing the education anyway. Um. Okay, land over here. You're about to get there. Sector scanned. I'm hoping there's no dust storm right now. We really can't take New anything else that would crush arrived. our tempo. Colonists are departing. Okay. I do want to turn these on, but not yet. Actually, I'll pre-amplify them. And... I'll make sure this is in place. I don't think this generates any science by itself, so I think we want to turn this off until we've got the others turned on. You're going to launch. Yeah. Turn you off. Although, we'll ready the Amplify. Uh, I guess if we're only running these on one shift. Yeah, we just need them to Dredger match. Detected. Uh, another Dredger has landed on Mars. Let's move you over here and trash you. What's your time at? Seven days. Oh, man. Anomaly analyzed. I mean, our effective tech rate is really good because the amount of discounts we're packing. 41 Martian born. Okay. Turn these on. They'll have to be repaired first. I need to make sure I have enough funding to have this active right at the end. I think we will, because we are still exporting some rare metals and things. So let me outsource this now we could still use the tech boost at this moment. Uh, power's going down? Really? Is something broken? Maybe? I don't know. But I'm going to build another fusion generator over here. All the material will be here right away, and then we'll upgrade it right away for some more power gen. Anomaly found. 
you guys are both full, which is great. Okay, so we'll go and enable this as well. Anomaly analyzed. And we'll land you, say, here. Maybe you'll work over here as quickly as possible. I don't know. And Colonel Fusion, go, go, go. Then you can kick all the people out of here. I don't actually want them working there. Um, we still have... Uh, okay, what I'm going to do now is we're going to turn this off. We're going to turn these off. Uh, I'll leave the electronics one running on one shift. We may import some more electronics. We have some unemployed people right now, but they're just going to shuffle around to different domes. Funding received. I'm going to enable the second shift on that. And on that. And you're ready to launch, so you will. And passenger rocket, please to be coming home. Okay. All right, well, we're going to put a cut in here. This is going to be really tight, you guys. So we have six souls to boost our science rate to 10,000. That's going to be really tight. We'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.